Let's go. Let's go. We didn't even have to figure out uh, anything else. Like this thing here. Which we'll probably have to figure out eventually. Oh? Huh? I don't like that. Wait, what? 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 <laughs> oh, I don't know what that means. That's not doing anything right now. Oh, we got more symbols here. Oh, that was from earlier, I guess. Okay. What is this? No clue. What is this? Oh, maybe this is something we can figure out. Oh, okay. So this is like starts with a dude. That's the answer to the puzzle. You think that one was the answer? This was the answer to the puzzle? Because it does have that skull on it. You're right. And it's not like I need to solve it. Oh, yes, it is actually. Um, some complicated things going on here, chat. Dominoes. Yeah, it looks like dominoes. I want to get this one figured out. This one looks fun. So I've got to probably come in through here and go out through there. That one doesn't go there. Okay. Right. Let's just see if this works here. Does this fill up everything? Can we just see that real quick? If this fills up everything? All right, I don't, no, it obviously does not fill up everything. Okay. Hmm. Interesting. 100 bits from Cyclone. Thank you. Start some bottom left top. Yeah, but I think I also need to uh, hit these, no? I think that's why those are there. Like, it's got to look... Here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking it's something like this. And then something like that. Is what I'm thinking. Okay. Okay. Now, is there one at the bottom? There's this. Oh, thanks, Half Elf. <clears throat> so, I think we got to start from the top. Uh, here's a good starting point because this one can't be a sideways one. So, it has to be one of these four, right? So, it's either going to start and go over or it's going to start and go under. So, I, I think over is a good option. Now that it's over, we got to get over here, right? So then we would need something like this. Something like that. Oh, no, because there's no headdress plus that. That's the only one that's there. Okay. 
Hmm. So then maybe we need to start under. Okay. So if we start under, it starts with this one here, and it goes here, right? It goes around here. Uh, it goes, and then we need like another one of these ones, right? So let's go ahead and do this one. Now we can go to the side still. So we can, we can do something like this. Now we can do woman in a headdress. We can do this one here. And now we need one at the bottom, so it's only this one. Ah, see, now we have none to touch that. Oh, wait, no, wait, wrong, wrong, wrong. This one goes here. Hey. Boom. But still, still no good. So that one cannot go there. Which means that one's right. This one has to be that. Unless it keeps going. Start from the top. I can start from the top. Nice. Thank you, Ryan Ants, for the gifted. There you go, half elf. No, it can't be that one. It goes here like this, and then I can get address on top. That doesn't work because then I'll need a double one. And that, wait, address, no, because I need double one here and I don't have that, so that doesn't work. Got two of these. That just doesn't work. Okay. So maybe I start with a side one here. Something like this. Walk on the edge, yeah. So go in, go in like that, okay. So let's say this here, right? And then we can go here. That's totally fine. This is all good for now. This is really good. Yes, this works. This one here, this one here, this one here, this one here. Let's go. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Does that, does that reveal something here? Ah, it's a three combination. Got it. It's one, two, and three. Nice. Oh, this is the dice game. Oh, I see, I see. Mexican Yeti 92, thank you for the tier one. Let's get a welcome in chat. So the dice game is going to give me the first thing. The square game gave me the second thing, and the circle game is going to give me the third thing. That makes a lot of sense to me. What's this, by the way? Is that what we have to do over there? This here? These two, these two, these two, and those two? Let's try it. So is it like these two, these two? Yeah, it was that whole row and then top right, okay. So it's boom, 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 and then top right. I see, because that one's already there. That makes sense. So the two that go together would like, would this one, hold on, would this one and this one go together? No. Hmm. Match color to color or shape to shape. Okay. But these two have to go, these two have to go, these two have to go, these two have to go together. So for instance, this one and this one, right? Those will go together because they're shapes. That makes sense, right? Nice. 
Tamara J92, thank you for the prime. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Okay. And then we have what? We have this one and this one, which match up, right? So we have that and that that matches up. For top, we have this one. Oh, I see. This works because of that. That works because of that. That touches that. I hope so. I hope this make, uh, this is making sense. The star, do we have any of them that have a green star? No, we do not. You think green goes with green? Like with this one? Official Benji, thank you for the host. Edge symbols connect. Big symbol with green. They do not need to be connected. <laughs> Conflicting answers, question mark. So these two have to work. These two have to work. These two have to work. And these two have to work according to the grid. Right? Because if you look here, chat, this, this is what we're trying to do. Okay. Let's do that. These two, these two, these two, these two. I don't think they all have to interconnect. But maybe they have to make sense somehow. So let's say this one because the star connects to the star. I mean, let's just try following the pattern, see if that works, because that works, actually. See, now they kind of end. So maybe this one, because of that, I don't know. The solution is in the circles you can turn. You think so? I think this is another puzzle. How is this the solution? Is it like this? Amanda with the five. Thank you so much, Amanda 1289. Nice. Appreciate that. Let's get a hot dang in chat for Amanda. Nice. Is this your answer? Is this what you're looking for here? Don't connect outer symbols, but outer nice. with inner instead. Outer with inner instead. Oof. So hard to understand what you're saying. Outer with inner. I see what you're saying. Okay, let's try that. So, inner symbol would be here. Right? Okay, this might make sense. Oh, right, because look, the skull connects with the green skull. This connects with this. Yeah? So this one would go here because that's this one. Ooh, that's a bit complicated, isn't it? All right, we got a, we got this one here. But see, it just falls apart here. It doesn't really work. It doesn't really work though. Only green can connect. Okay, so if only greens connect. There's no greens left though, that's what I'm saying. Like, you're not, that doesn't make any sense. So 
So this green one is stuck here. You only have to match two from the drawing. I don't know if that's true. <laughs> I dare you, chat, to read everyone's answer. <laughs> it's so hard to read any of what you guys are saying. It's so hilarious reading what you guys are typing. I'm reading. I can read. I, I have eyeballs. I don't understand what any of that means. Okay, who wants to who wants to try solving it? I'm gonna get I'm gonna get chat to solve this one. No, stop typing. Stop stop typing what to do. Who wants to solve it? Alright. Let's go. Uh Folked Folked G. Folk D G. Okay. I'm not reading anything else, by the way, right now. So you don't have to you don't have to tell me. Folked G, you are up, sir, or madam. Um, and which tile goes where? So, ready, Folked? I'm going to grab a tile like this one. Where does this go? We're only, we're only letting Folk G answer right now. <laughs> I picked the wrong Folken guy. Over the one they're on. Okay, well, Folk, you are now officially eliminated. Who else wants to uh, yeah, get, get Folked on? Um, who else wants to have a go? All right, Tamara, Tamara Jade 92. Tamara Jade 92, do you have what it takes? Where does, where does any of them go? Over there, <laughs> over the one they're on. <laughs> Samira, what do I do? Put it on top right for now. Got it. Okay. Uh, this one. Violet, this isn't your turn. We're letting Tamara decipher this one. This is hard. Yeah, yeah, it's harder than it looks, isn't it? All right, look, we're going to reset this. We're going to go do a different one in the meanwhile. I think we're all too confused at this point. Okay. One, two, four, one. Excuse me. What is this? Okay. Okay. We got to find the ones that are already there. This one is already there. Let's wait for that one. Come on. There. One beside and three. One beside and three. No, that doesn't work at all. We gotta find the right pattern, right? Can't move the inner ones. The colored lines on the wall matter too, right? Do they though? Because it's a different shape. Oh, it's the same shape. You're right. Okay, I'm trying to figure out what the lines mean on the wall. Is it one of those things where everything has to just be different on every one of the lines? So for instance, like we can have this here and this here because they don't appear kind of like a Sudoku type thing. You know what I'm saying? But no, because there's more. Okay. Oh. Lines, okay, so it's four cubes, break them up. The flat surfaces based off the car. Okay, that makes sense to me. Okay. Four cubes, you're right, okay. Boom, boom, boom. So that one underneath is that, okay, hold on. So I have to find the ones that are already beside it though. I gotta find the cubes that are already there. 
Uh, that one. Yep. Nope. That is wrong. Oh, and that's how the cubes are made? Hmm, okay. So this green cube, let's say, would be here. Boom, boom, boom. Right? It would be four and then two over. So it would be that one all the way down to here. This one and that one would be the green cube. And so we're looking for a dot with a three under, which is this one. This is the one. This is the green cube. This is the green cube here. It has... Okay, the one, three is under, that is under that. What is at the very top? It is a four. Okay, so I, I think I think this one goes here. Okay. Now we're looking to... There's got to be a two to the right of the one. Yes. Okay, so a two is there, which means on the other side is a flat line. Boom. Flat line goes here. That makes sense to me. That is exactly that cube. Yep. Okay. So let's look at a different line up here. That was this one. The rest are going to get a little bit more complicated. This one's not so complicated. The blue one. So it's uh, this one, this one, this one, and the fourth one up here, plus the three and a blank here. So we're looking for a three next to a four. For a three next to a four. Oh, it's this one. That's a one over there. That's on the bottom, okay. One and three, okay. I think, I think this one here is one and three, which is this one here. Three to a line, yep. No, because where does that line one come from? Hmm. Oh, the bottom row isn't filled and you think I counted it? Oh, is that what happened? Oh, right. Okay. So it's this one and this one. Right. Which would make the three go here and the one go here. Now that would make sense. Yeah. One next to the line next to that. Yep. That's good. Okay. We're good here. So we've got two of them figured out. The other ones are a little bit more complicated. Uh, so that one's going to be two, one, three, something, right? For this one here, it goes something, two, one, three, something, something. And it's gotta be either this one or this one. So let's try to figure that out. Two, one, three, something, something. And the other one is this one. So it goes boom, 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 boom. And that one already has a line in it. Right. Okay, this one I believe to be this one here. Be only because the two and the three are uh, touching and there's no two and three touching here because the two is there. If it goes boom, 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 the three shouldn't be touching the two 
uh, at all, even fold it up on itself. Actually, it would fold it up on itself. It would. Far left dice is yellow. The far left one is yellow. Okay. So two, what's above the two? Far left dice is yellow. This is a really hard one here. So above the two, beside the two is a one. So the top one's a three. No, because the three is there. Oh. Jeez, this is tough. Might be easier to draw it out. Might be. Actually, might be. You have no idea what's going on. So here are basically these cubes are opened up kind of like you would do in math class when you were in like grade school where you would take a cube and like open it up. And those are the different patterns that it's opening up to. We have to figure out which one of these is that pattern. And then once that's done, map out what it would look like if it was opened up. One for yellow. Top one is a one. Okay. All right, chat. I'm with you. Top one's a one. That's impossible. Sorry. Because this has to go like this. And that would mean the one is used twice. Which is completely wrong. So that cannot be... That cannot be it. Sorry, chat. That is wrong. Uh, but that gives us information. The one cannot be here because then this wouldn't make sense, right? So the one definitely has to go on a different one. Uh, ones that we are missing here. Are we have two, we have three, we have one. So it would need to be like a line, a dotted line, or a four. Right? So let's say it's a four, and the four looks... Actually looks like it's next to the one, which would make that one impossible. I think the four would go on top. Dot line on the top? Okay, let's try dot line on the top. Let's see. Dot line on top, and then two. Nope, that doesn't work. Not if it's this cube. Because dot line on top, it would be touching a three, which is touching a two. The far left is pink, you think? Yeah, that might make sense. Which would make the yellow uh, this one here, right? Two, four. Hold on. Hold on. This is it. This is it. I got it. Watch, 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 watch. Three on top. Three on top. Three on top, line in the bottom, yep. Wait. That's impossible, can't be. Can't be three, because we already have a three. Ooh, 
It's four, right? Yeah. The colors represent which way the cube unfolds. Correct. Blue is the far left cube. Look where the colored line starts above the spring line. Blue is a far left cube. Yeah, we've done blue already. Uh, but it was this one. It wasn't the far left one. Three. Third one is yellow. Uh, okay. If third one is yellow, I'm fine with that. It goes bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. So the two, one, and the three have to be kind of in a corner. Three, and so the two should be there. That's the two, correct. Okay. Okay. This is making sense. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I think a four goes up there, yeah? And since the four and the line are touching, the line has to be the last one. I fold it like this. The line has to be here. Top left, it's two, you think. All right. It's just. Hey, let's go. <sighs> so glad that's done with. I'll be really frank with you guys. Very glad that that's done. Hot dang. Moving on. We got a second uh we got a second thing here. All right, folks, back to this demon of a puzzle. Um we had this clue. But this is also a puzzle. It's not just a clue. You got to remember that. Uh, this, I think, happens when we solve the other one. Because, look, it's a puzzle. So I think we need to solve the other one and then use this. I don't think this is a clue. I think once we solve the other one, it gives us a solution to what this is. Voltac, calm down. All right, no yelling here. Uh, <laughs> the green symbol needs to match the center of the tile touching the green symbol. It's like this. Yeah? We all agree that this feels like... This feels right. Um, that being said, this one would be right, yeah? Because this one matches this, and this one matches this. But this is where we are stuck, you understand? You understand this, right? Tile 2 is top left. No, no, yes, no, yes, no, 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 it's not. It's okay. We don't have enough greens. There are only these symbols that are green. 
We only have five green tiles. It is impossible for six tiles to match up. Red means can't be that symbol. Green means it is. Green in the middle sides. What? Green outer position of matching inner symbol. Huh? That's what I'm thinking. Only two have to match up like the patterns on the walls. All right. These two need to match up. These two need to match up. These two need to match up. And these two need to match up. It does feel like there's a rule here that we don't know. Corky beans. You want to try? Sure. Why not? Corky beans. Go ahead. You have the floor. Tell me which middle symbol you would like to place. So like microchip, snowflake, rotary phone, flower, or sun, flower, star. Which one would you like? Corky beans. Let's go. Star in the middle. Okay, perfect. Star was this one in the middle. Got it. Oh, Sarge is going to gift you a sub if you get this, Corky beans. Over the one there on. Skull above the temple. Okay. You wanted this one here instead? Flower top right, he says. Okay. Oh, wait. You want a flower. You want a flower up there. Not the sun. The other flower in the first spot. Got it, got it. It was right before... Number three to number one. No idea what that means. Got to be more specific. Oh, this one goes to number one, you mean? Like this? You're doing it, Corky. First tile on the left goes into number five. Wait, what is number five? Down here. Bottom middle. Let's go, Corky! Hey, let's get a hot dang in chat. And Corky gets himself a gifted. At a boy. Great job. Fantastic. I don't get it. Neither do I. Uh, wait, so that doesn't actually give us anything. So all that that gives us is the solution to the other one. Right? Flower, flower touching, scone thing touching. Taking a picture of this. Nice. Let's go. Thank you, Sarge. Very generous of you. There you go, Corky. All right. So here we have uh, this. Not sure. 
Oh, they change. The symbols change. Oh. Um. Ah. Uh. Okay, these are all the symbols everywhere, but there are extra symbols, it seems like, even. Hmm. The pattern on the right is the hint. Oh, I see. So one and two. Oh, wait. No, because there's only four things. Okay, yeah, okay, that makes sense. So one and two was Uh, this one. No, that doesn't make sense at all. The middle, yeah, no, I have it here. I just, uh, it's not making complete sense to me. Which one goes where? So I'm just trying to match. So let's say one of them needs to be flower and rotary phone. All I'm looking for right now is flower and rotary phone, which is not there. Not there. Flower, rotary phone. Got it. Now I need snowflake and uh, star. Snowflake, which uh, looks like this one. And star, so it's not this one. Snowflake and no. Uh, snowflake and I think so. No, is that the flower? Oh yeah, it's not the star. Okay, so it's gotta be on this one. There it is. Now I need stairs and microchip. Right there. And now I need flower and skull. Oh, this is not working. Okay. Top left. Top left, top left, top left, top left. Uh, stairs and snowflake. That one works. Unless skull and flower. There we go. I don't know. Don't know how that worked, but we got it. All right, uh, now we need to look at uh, dominoes, that and that. So dominoes was, okay, the half, this sort of semicircle, that one. Uh, then we jump to that, and then it jumps to that. So that and that.
Boom. Here we are. Ooh. Oh, this is going to be one of those things where, like... Oh, uh, this is like a maze here. That only opens that door. Thank you, Jay Dance, for the host. Okay, all right. And what about over here? That opens that. Uh huh. Yeah. That's where I need to get to, right? Oh, so it closes that one. Yeah. Ha, it hasn't been that difficult. Now let's go home to sell it. Okay. How do we go home? Aidma, time to go. Robert, while you were working, I have taken the liberty of looking for another location where you could find a treasure of greater value. Ooh. If it's as simple as getting the skull, it's worth going through the rough patch one more time. Wise decision, Robert. Destination, Alchemy Laboratory of Dr. Flamel, Paris, year 1357. Establishing time coordinates, activating cool. time jump. Time travel completed. Whew. <laughs> I, I can't get used to this feeling. Aidma, what fantastic treasure will we find here? Here you will find a poison that can kill any human with a single drop without leaving any trace. Incredible. Let's get to it. <laughs> He's so stoked about finding poison. Ooh, very Da Vinci-esque. Very Da Vinci-esque. I like this place. Okay. Phases of the moon. Got it. Okay, this has got room vibes all over it. Nice. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, hello. Need something to start the fire. Got it. There's these. Okay. Ooh, this is going to be an adventure here, chat. We got the moon phases. Okay. Mm-hmm. Jeez Louise. This is going to be a complicated one. Dang, only about 100 subs left, and I dress up like Da Vinci. That's right, baby. And we got all this in here. That's probably where it's at. Okay. Chat, you guys want to give me five minutes? I have to go to the washroom. I'm going to make another coffee, and I'll be right back. Is that something you can do? Hang out here for a sec? Yeah. 